So we've had a lot of questions lately about how to get all your LEDs hooked up to the Night Owl system to all match when you turn them to white. Um, as you see here, um, the Night Owl Halo Kit that we have installed does not match the LED driving light bulbs that we have installed. Um, so we want to color correct the Halo Kit. Um, so to do that, we'll go into the module screen and then we'll choose the module that has the device that we want to correct. Um, and then we'll go to this color correction setting um, and this will basically adjust the white value um, of that device. So whenever that device goes to white, um, it'll actually just go to this instead. Um, so as you can see here, these halos are a little pinkish. So we'll turn down the red um, and if you see, we can turn it down even more and you might be able to see this, but now they're really blue. Um, so we'll just tweak this value and now they're um, a little, still a little blue, so we'll bring down the blue. Um, and as you can see, just that, those little adjustments have really made them uh, match a whole lot closer. Um, so we'll just save that and now um, that will be the white that it goes to. Um, so now people have also asked about our driving light halo kit. Um, I'm going to show you how to match those. It's the same process. Um, I'm going to go down here real quick and turn off our driving light bulb so that you can see the halos. Um, and I'll go over to the halo module for our driving light halos. Um, and go ahead and set that default to white so that we can see it. And as you can see, by default, the driving light halos are very blue. Um, and so we'll again go into the color correction setting. We'll turn down the blue and then we'll turn down the green a little bit. And there you can see they match pretty closely. Um, and you can sit here and tweak it. If you want to get finer control, you just touch the slider and then bring your finger down away from it and there's a lot more precision you have there. Um, so you tweak it until you get it the color you like and then you hit save. Um, and then whenever you run a program, all your colors will always match.